Yo, what's up guys? Moza here bringing you a new video on the fastest way to kill the butcher. So let's talk about the hunter build. The first thing you're going to want to equip is a ranged primary of your choice. I went with the carabiner or however you pronounce it. Just whatever you're most comfortable with in case you run into players at a long distance. The most important part of this build, however, is the sword. This weapon you will use to down the butcher in just 10 seconds, along with one tapping any player that is unfortunate enough to cross your path. Every hunter should also have a med kit in case they are damaged by the boss, players, or zombies, and then a flashlight in case the butcher lair spawns in a very dark area. Finally, you're going to want to equip at least one stamina shot. It is very important that you do this because if you don't have a stamina shot on you, you will unfortunately run out of stamina during the boss fight and trust me, you don't want that to happen. Feel free to equip explosives as well in case you run into a situation where another hunter is like camping in a building or something and it'll get you a very easy kill. As you see here, using a ranged weapon and a sword combo effectively helped us to kill every player in the lobby and really this helped us get our most successful match yet. Now that you're in the butcher's lair, you're going to want to use your stamina shot and attack the butcher at the same time as your partner so you can successfully stagger the boss and render him harmless. Be very careful to distance yourself from your partner while you fight the butcher. As you can see, I accidentally downed my partner because I lunged way too far. While you banish the butcher, it is best that you and your partner cover different entry points into the lair so you can immediately down any hunters that are left and try and contest the bounty. This will leave you with a safe extraction and a successful speed run on the butcher. I hope you all enjoyed this video and found it helpful. If you did, be sure to smash that like button. And if you'd like to see more content like this, don't forget to subscribe. And like always, I will see you on the next video.